What is up, guys? Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a flagpole for the back of your truck, and it's probably not the most conventional way, but it will work, hopefully. So basically, what I got here is I got this broomstick from Walmart, and I got I got this fishing rod holder. Now, I'm gonna be mounting the fishing rod holder to the back of my truck with self-tappers, and I'm gonna be mounting the flag to this pole. I'm probably gonna paint the broomstick black, and I'm probably gonna paint the rod holder black just because I like, I don't like white and fucking brown in the bed of my black truck. So I'm gonna be doing that. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do it. So, enjoy the video. All right, so this is what I got. Got my rod holder. I got my flag attached to my flagpole here, i.e., the broomstick. Don't worry about it. Uh, if you don't like it, you can fucking sit on the tip of that. But I'm gonna go ahead and scuff this up, and I'm gonna spray paint it black, and then I'm gonna put it in. I'm gonna attach it to the bed of my truck with some self tappers. Then I'm gonna drop the flagpole in it, and eventually, eventually, I might paint it black. I don't know yet. I don't feel like doing that right now, but I am painting this black right now, so stay tuned. All right, as you can see, I got the rod holder in. Just two self-tappers, one up top, one at the bottom. It's painted black. It looks like shit, but I'm not really concerned about it. All that's left to do is just drop the flag, pull in it. All right, guys, well, there you have it. She's on there. The, uh... It's not as long as I thought it was going to be. My flag is way longer than I thought. There's only that much sticking off, but I mean, it's not that big of a deal. But as you can see, it's all tightened down. It's all fastened. Got my flag on. It looks redneck as hell, but hey, that's what we're all about here. So, if you like seeing videos like this, give me a like. Give me a thumbs up. Let me know. I'll make more videos like this. Well, there you guys have it. I know that was a pretty short video. Figured I'd go ahead and show you guys how to do it. It's not exactly the way I would have liked it to be, but whatever works. It's redneck ingenuity, and that's what we're all about here. So you can see it back there. It's going to hold together. At least I hope it will. But all together, it cost me $10 to buy the broomstick and to buy the rod holder. I bought that, that flag, that thin blue line flag you see, a couple months ago when I was up in North Carolina visiting my girlfriend. So I already had that. But it's cheap, it's quick, and it's easy. So all you need for this is some self-tappers, a rod holder, a broomstick, or any type of pole you'd want. I didn't go with like a regular flag pole because they tend to be flimsy and they tend to just flop over and lose their structural integrity over time. So I didn't go with that. So it's just a wooden broomstick and I zip tied the flag on and it's basically all it is. It's quick and easy. I spray painted the rod holder black because I don't want a white rod holder in my bed. But if you're thinking about doing something like this, this is one idea. There's millions of other ways to do it. You can do more expensive and buy the right shit, but I chose not to. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to me if you enjoy my videos. I'll leave a link to my other videos at the end of this one. Hope you guys have a great night.